Hello there, and welcome to another video. We are doing a new series called Zeta Order, and we are covering the 501st. I should not be worried about losing this battle. Okay, yep, they, their mods are terrible. But yes, basically what it is is that we are going to Zeta Order the entire 501st, and with the 501st, we are going to see what Zetas work with what, so basically, I'd like to start off with saying that the first Zeta that you should be putting on your clones, I'm leaving Gas as the last one because he is probably the last one that you will go out and get of the 501st squad. So Gas is at the end, he gets the last four Zetas, unless you are able to get him earlier before you have Zetas for everyone else. So the first Zeta, I would say, goes on Fives of Sacrifice. Where if you defeat a 501st enemy, or a 501st ally, not enemy, you then lose the, uh, then you just, you know, lose the chance of, um, then you, j if they die, god, it's speed, offense, health, max health, max protection, that all goes on to all their 501st ally, 501st clone allies, I should say. I know he's fractured. I'm so worried. Actually, I kind of am. I should be worried. But then I would say put the next Zeta onto... Um... Why am I blinking? Put the first next Zeta onto... Uh... Rex. So Zeta 1 goes on 5s. Zeta 2 goes on Rex. Zeta 3 goes back on 5s because 5s is that useful of a unit. And then it put uh, the Zeta on Echo for uh, if you evade a attack that you lose and you get true damage dealt to you by like a certain percentage of max health. And then put the next one, or actually no, it's put the Orc Trooper Zeta on because the Orc Trooper Zeta is really, really useful. I'm going to hold up. I need to double check. These two are Zetas, yes. I don't know. I don't know if it echoes to Zeta. I completely forgot. I'll double check. Hold up. No, yeah, right. Echo was one in Zeta. Ah, my mind is just going nuts right now. But yeah, so you'd put the two on fives. You put the one on fives for his sacrifice, you put the one on Rex for himself, you put the second one on fives, you put the fourth Zeta onto Arc Trooper, and you put the fifth Zeta onto, um... You put the fifth Zeta on Echo. And then, last but certainly not least, you put the, uh... Oh dear, that's, that's great. You put the last Zeta on to, um, God, why can my brain not think anymore? But yeah, put the last Zeta on Echo. And then at that time, you're going to have gas or you're going to be running Shakti clones. So you put the two uh, Zetas on Shakti clones or you put them on gas. Really nice and simple. And the only other 501st member is Ahsoka Tano, but you're going to be using her with Padme, so that's going to be a separate video for that team. Anyways, I'd like to uh, end this here. Right, we're at a perfect time. That is all that needs to be known, is that the Zeta order for the 501st is quite simple. Fives, Rex, Fives, or Trooper, Echo. And then, if you're using Shock T, you put Shock T before Echo and Arc. And if you're using Gas and you don't have, and you don't have any of the other Zetas, you just prioritize Gas Zetas, which it, it works. It's simple. The 501st is a small faction. That's why I did it. It was a nice, easy, nice, easy layup to do to start a new series. Because the Sokotan doesn't count. Just ignore that she's there. Anyways, that is all for this video. I'll see you in the next one.